good morning. Today it's a bit cloudy, a bit dreary, so I thought I'd wear my summer best. I got a chance to talk to a di number of different people over the last couple of days, and they were saying the hardest thing about this world we live in now is just how little we are allowed to do. And not because they feel like they are somehow entitled to go do things, but we feel like we should be active. We should be out there. We should be involved in doing things. It's in our nature. And it made me think about when Jesus had resurrected and was with Simon Peter. And in John chapter 21, Jesus and Peter have this conversation. When they had finished breakfast, Jesus said to Simon Peter, Simon, son of John, do you love me more than these? And he said to him, yes, Lord, you know that I love you. And Jesus said, feed my lambs. A second time he said to him, Simon, son of John, do you love me? And he said to him, yes, Lord, you know that I love you. Jesus said to him, tend my sheep. He said to him a third time, Simon Peter, son of John, do you love me? Peter felt hurt because he had said to him the third time, do you love me? And he said to him, Lord, you know everything. You know that I love you. Jesus said to him, feed my sheep. Oftentimes when people introduce themselves to other people, one of the first things that we say is, oh, my name is Keith and I'm, and then whatever our job is, a pastor, or I'm uh, the father of three kids. One is the job and the other is who I am in relationship with others. In this passage, it kind of shows both. We are brothers and sisters in Christ. We are children of God. We are the beloved, meaning that we are beloved by God. And we are called to a task. And that task is going out and feeding the sheep showing God's love to other people, declaring to other people that there is hope, there is an opportunity to find peace, to find love, to find comfort, because there is a God. And even in this time, that God is with us. I hope that this week you are able to feel God's love. And in so feeling the love, feel the relationship so that you can then go forward and may not be doing exactly what you used to do or what you will be doing next month, but you will be doing something as a child of God, feeding the sheep, tending to and caring for a world in need. Let us pray. God, help us to see who we are. Help us to identify ourselves as your children that you love. And with knowledge of that love, with an experience of that love, let us go forward caring for the people around us, having that job be one of the biggest jobs that will be on our plate for the next couple of weeks. We make this prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. Have a blessed day.